Welcome to part 1 of building a wooden air engine. This will be the introduction for the series where I will show how all the parts are made and all the steps it takes to make one. This first part will show how I make the cylinder block. The first thing that I do before making a new air engine is to choose what kind of wood I'm going to use. And in this case I'm going to use the wood that you can see right here. The next step is to take some measurements, so I can decide on how big the cylinder block should be. And the first measurement that I need is the thickness of the material, which in this case is 41mm. To make things a little bit easier, I will instead make the cylinder block 40mm. Ok, so now when I know how wide the cylinder block will be, I will choose a drill bit that doesn't look too big or too small relative to the material thickness. And this time I chose a 20mm force nerve. Now when I know what kind of drill I'm going to use and also know that I'm going to drill the cylinder block from both sides, I want to know how long I can make the cylinder block. So in order to figure that out I just need to measure the drill bit length and uh, multiply that by 2. And in this case the drill bit is 5.5 centimeters. Multiply that by 2 and it's 11. So let's say I'm going to make the cylinder block 10 centimeters long. Alright, I have all the needed measurements and information. So it's finally time to make the part.